That it was the national anthem of the Black Sharks of Ghana. Well, that, that was the oh, first go. What a strike. My own oh mind, the number four man, Kim Tiko, gets the opener for the Black Sharks. And he gave him that beautiful strike there. Well executed by Tiko in the Black Sharks. Are ahead by a goal to nil in the tournament so far. And it tells you that we have three half to win. First half is 12. And he goes for a long strike. But it's like a beautiful save by the goalkeeper there. He has done that for the Ghana team on countless occasions. And he comes into the game with so much experience. Ibrahim got the equalizer there. That is the number three man instead who got the goal. It was an error that Robert, the goalkeeper for the Black Shark, couldn't have conceded. San Ferros of Egypt won. Goalkeeper Robert goes for the long strike. Beautiful save. That they have been to the African Cup so many times. They've been in position. That is the goal. That is the goal. That is the goal. Beautiful strike there. The Black Sharks lost concentration there. Extraordinary for them to be able to, to pull parity here on this particular occasion. And I, I know, based on what I've seen in the MTNFA Cup, because the rules governing the B-Soccer has changed. And that was a strike. And with that, because of the Black Sharks not being in the tournament for some quite time now. Errors from the goalkeeper. It could be lack of concentration there. Beautiful strike. Beautiful strike. He's. Uh, I will let Walanyo Wallace tell us something about this. Are these some of the things that you've been expecting from your schemer, that is uh, uh, Richard Osa? Another opportunity for the Pharaohs to make it three. He goes for the strike. What a blunder. What a goal, Egypt. And my oh my, that, that is, that is a blunder. And the Egyptians are experienced enough to be able to, 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 to pick their moment. But I think they should play much more balls to Osa. And face to face, that is the equalizer. Sema, the captain of the Black Sharks. He picked his moment, picked his time and the precision to be able to finish the way he did. Like I said, it's a fantastic game. The atmosphere, the crowd, the excitement is uh, it's making the whole oh, great finish that is well. The number three man of the Black Sharks, Eugene. Eugene Dekbe. Great finish there, Black. The Black Sharks have gotten their momentum and they are back in the game. My three man releases the ball to Tiko. What can Tiko do? He goes for the strike. Beautiful save. What a strike. What a strike. Go King. Can you make it two out of two? He goes for the strike. Beautiful save by the goalkeeper. Mohamed El Saeed. Mohamed El Saeed has really stepped up this afternoon for. That was a brilliant strike there. 4-4 for the Egyptians. Goal scored by number two man, Ibrahim Hassan. They have a game plan that they are playing. No poor mark in there. The Black Sharks look so tired. And can they make it five? What hits the crossbar? What a strike by Tiko. One, two, three. Olua! Olua! What a strike on this particular occasion. Look, had no chance to pull any save on that particular occasion. Putting the black shots 5 4 in the ascendancy. Now, joining us, I can see you are all joy watching Ghana be soccer. What do you make of this? Uh, well, um, first of all, it's very interesting. It's one of the sports that has been there. So, we've been in touch with the team. They have the goal scorer, Michael Osa, still on the pitch. Beautiful save by the goalkeeper. Olua! The number seven man, Victor. Oh! Wisdom Adeka. Let's look at this from this angle. Look. Look at it. Black. Look at it from this angle. Olua! Olua! The victory in their first encounter. That's King Yaompo for you there. What a competition. The big man on the pitch. They are happy. They don't care the margin of defeat or win from the Laboma Beach Resort. My oh my beautiful atmosphere. Look at the sportsmanship being displayed by the Black Sharks. They are shaking the hands of the Sun Ferris. Oh my.